Hey folks! Welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix a low contrast color image. In my previous video, I wrote a program to fix a low contrast grayscale image. I will use the same program for today's task. So, here we have our code from previous video. If you haven't seen that video, I will put the link in the description. You better check that out. We just have to modify a little. And our code will be ready to use on a color image as well. This is the low contrast image. We will use this as an example. So, we will now modify our previous program. We don't have to write everything from the scratch. I will remove this zero. So, that we can read a color image which have more than one channels. I will add another variable to get a number of channels of my input image. I will also extend my histogram variable so that it can accommodate histogram of each channel. I will change these single variables to arrays equal to the number of channels. This is because now we have multiple channels. So, we will have maximum and minimum intensity values for each channel. I initialize the maximum array with zeros and minimum array with 255 filled in it. Now, I will add another loop. This will allow my program to scan each pixel in every channel automatically. After adding the loop, now, I need to add channel variables. Our histogram function with minimum and maximum values is now ready. Now, it can accommodate a color image with multiple channels mean and max functions will remain the same. Now, it's time to modify my histogram equalization function. Similarly, in this case also, I have to add a channel variable. In order to initialize an identical image, I will add channels to the size of new image. Similarly, in this case also, I will add another loop for channels. So, it can scan all the pixels in each channels and calculate their new values. But, our equation remains the same. In this case, histogram equalization is being applied on each channel individually. After running this program, we will see the result output of this program. And here is our output result after being fixed by equalization. You can see the difference between these two images. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. Cheers.